Hi, YouTubers and much everybody's everywhere. It's Mark with GeorgeToon.com. I'm back with another video. You know, I was having a shave this past week and I was going through my razors and I wanted to just change things up. And I pulled out a razor that I hadn't used in a while and I had a shave and it was marvelous. I had forgotten how great this razor really is. It's just a terrific, terrific razor. And it's from the folks at Shaveology. Came, comes in a box like this. It's the Griffin Razor. And they, boy, they give you a lot of really good stuff uh, in this package. Beautiful packaging, and they give you a lot of nice extras along with it. Let me show you what the razor looks like. It's a beautiful three piece razor, it is beautifully chromed. Let me show you handle, base plate, cap, and it has beautiful, precise alignment. The handle has the Shaveology name etched, carved into the bottom of the handle. It has what I call this micro knurling, which is really nice. It's just very, very, very grippy. Has a nice weight. Overall, terrific balance. As I say, beautiful alignment. The cap has their logo etched into the top of it, which is terrific. And I had an absolutely great shave. And the nice thing about Shaveology is they offer a, a, a lot of products for your traditional wet shave. And the one thing that they have here that I absolutely love is their Shaveology Shave Cream. The secret ingredient, the secret, in, the secret ingredient here is golden seaweed. It has a lot of skin nourishing qualities, anti-aging, that sort of thing. And it is really, really terrific. I've been using this, uh, over the past year, you can see, I'm done with my last little bit, has a real nice earthy organic scent to it. Very, very nice, very fresh, but nice earthy organic fresh scent to it. Um, when you get the razor, they also give you some nice little extras. They give you a polishing cloth like this with uh, Shaveology on it. And uh, they give you a, a leather cover for your razor. So um, if you wanted to just take your razor with you, this is another razor. You can just take it like that, which is really kind of nice. And um, just throw it in your dab kit and you won't have to worry about reaching in to, with your razor if you have a blade installed, that sort of thing. It's, it's covered, it's protected. Really, really nice. So we're gonna have a shave with the, the Shaveology shaving cream with the golden seaweed. We're gonna finish it up with Shaveology two-in-one aftershave balm. This is really, really good, good stuff. They also offer that. They also offer pre-shave. They offer their own razor blades. But we're gonna have a shave with the shaving cream, the razor. We're gonna use a Gillette Wilkinson Sword blade this morning. Right there, Gillette Wilkinson Sword. I happen to pop this one in for that shave. Got a great result with it. Really, really nice. I'm going to be building a ladder in my Admiral Chairman shaving bowl. I'm going to be building a ladder in my Chairman shaving bowl. I'm going to be using my Bass Bore brush to whip up that lather. So that's me kind of all over the map here this morning. But I'm really excited to use this razor because I got such a great shave with it. It's probably one of my favorite three-piece razors that I have in my collection. Now. Shaveology sells also a butterfly twist open razor on Amazon. If you want the three piece razor, go to their website and let them know that you want the three piece razor. The Griffin, this is what I'm using this morning, and it is a terrific razor. It is as good as my high end Baxter razor. The Baxter of California razor is a rebranded Mule R89. And I'm telling you, the Shaveology razor is every bit as good as that. It is absolutely fantastic razor so we're going to wet the face and we're going to get going here i'm going to take this dump that in there i'm going to wet my face we're going to get going all right very good now i'm going to get some of this shaving cream and i got plenty in here and we're going to use about that much right there it has a a nice Oh, almost a little bit like an almost like a, an oatmeal consistency, which is really kind of neat. Very, very different. And we're going to just go ahead and rinse that out. I'm going to put a little bit of the remnant from my finger into that brush. And we're going to go about whipping up a lather. 
and this whips up very, very fast. Of course, this chairman shaving bowl. Oh, hey, let's get rid of some of this here. Okay, occupational hazard. There we go. This uh, chairman shaving bowl does a great job in whipping up lather because it, it's bead blasted, and it's like having a lot of small high points or small, um, you know, little smaller, rougher areas that just helps generate a lather. I'm going to add a little bit of water to this. This is coming along nicely, though. Right there. Very nice. Okay, we're going to set that aside. We're going to let that sit. Rinse my hands a little bit. We're going to get our blade, our Gillette Wilkinson sword blade. Okay, so we're going to put that in there like that. Right there, get my handle. And again, blade alignment is very, very precise. Very nice. Yeah, that's spot on the money. Let me show you. There's the logo. And there's the blade. And you know what? It looks rather aggressive. It's not. It really is a nice nice shave it's it's just really nice very very efficient okay a little more water and we're going to do this here we go very nice fresh scent but it has as i say an organic earthy quality to it but it really whipped up quickly, and I was really always been impressed by that with uh, shaving creams if they whip up qu quickly. Uh, you know, you got a good one. At least that's always been my feeling. I'm just going to do a little bit of face lather here just to generate a little more cushion, but other than that, I've got it covered here. Really nice, and I got plenty of shaving cream, more than enough for uh, three passes. Okay, so we're going to heat up our Griffin. Razor from Shaveology. Really nice balance. Feels great in the hand. As again, this micro knurling. I call it micro knurling. I don't know what they call it, but that's what I call it because it's so tight. It's so tight and uh, close together. We're going to give it a little swirl here in the warmer water. It's up to temperature now. All right, here we go. 30 degrees, a light touch. Let the razor do all the work, gentlemen. It doesn't even feel like you're cutting whisker. It just goes right through. Yeah, <laughs> I was so excited about this. Okay, I went in without telling you. That's the first pass down. We're gonna go ahead and do our rinse. Just so smooth. I mean, I'm on automatic pilot. That's why I forgot to look at the camera. It's just such a smooth shave. All right, let's lather up for our second pass. 
First pass was really nice. Very nice. That's when you know you got a nice razor when you're just shaving and you're on automatic pilot and you forget yourself and you're just in the, in the moment of the shave and you go right through it. Wow. I guess that's where I was, kind of in the zone. I'm sure you've been there too. This is, this Griffin razor for me is, is smoother and more efficient than the Merker HD34C. Smoother and more efficient than an Edwin Jagger. It really is a fantastic, fantastic razor. The Griffin, I'm gonna tell you again. The Griffin, three-piece, three-piece razor. Um, as I say, they make a butterfly razor. I don't have that one. I can't speak to how, how that shaves, but I do know that this one looks great, feels great, absolutely performs so well. And um, uh, it's, you know, it's, it hits it out of the park on, on that checklist. I mean, it really does. And all that, it just checks all the boxes and knocks it out of the park. Really, very, very nice. And I think it's only like $25. And you get all that other great stuff with it that I pointed out. All right, we're gonna go east to west across the grain. All right, that's the second pass down. Let's rinse. <laughs> wow. Wow. I'm done. That is a wonderful, wonderful shave. Now, I'm good for the office. I'm really, I'm just perfect for the office. If I want to get closer, uh, you know, I could do a, I could do a third pass and maybe, no, I'm done. That's, that's really, really nice. I'm done. Okay, we're going to do <laughs> two passes. That's terrific. Really terrific shaving cream. Terrific razor. Wow. Really? Yeah, that's nice. That's very, very nice. All right, we're going to go ahead and do my uh, two final rinses. Warm from the tap and then cold. Here we go with my warm water rinse. Okay, it's a nice shave. We're gonna go with our cold water rinse now. Nice and cold. Okay, I got a clean, fresh towel waiting for me here. Oh. That's nice. Very, very nice. Now, that's a nice shave. That's really, really nice. Now I could have done a third pass and gotten really, really close, but I do want to move the video along. Other razors that I have, like the Vikings Blade Chieftain, the Vulcan, same way, I can do two passes and get just a terrific, terrific shave. Um, and that third pass, you're cleaning up a little bit here and there if you need it, but, but boy, that was a great shave. That was a great shave. So that's usually where I'm at. I'm at two to three passes, depending on how I'm running in the morning. But uh, with a razor like this and some of the other really nice high-end razors that I have, the Fender Hand, the Vikings Blade Chieftain, the Vulcan, um, what else is out there? Uh, can't remember off the top of my head. I'm usually good for two passes and then, uh, you know, I'm done. Uh, I've noticed with the Merker HD34C, I need three passes. With the Edwin Jaggers, I need three passes. And that's just the nature of the razor. That's not saying they're good or bad. It's just that razor, my skin. That's really just the way it is. Okay, so we're going to finish it off with the Shaveology 2-in-1. This stuff is really, really good. And I'm down my last little bit on this too. So I'm going to have to get some more of this and some more of the shaving cream. Hmm. 
nice scent really very very nice has some good stuff in there some good moisturizers I don't believe it has alcohol in it I'd have to check the ingredients again but I think it's alcohol free and we're gonna put a little bit here on the top and it really does moisturize and protect and it really is some good stuff. I'm glad I'm using this today too because the weather is very, very changeable. We've been warm, then we've been cold. So I think this is just perfect for that. Great shave. Really, really great shave. I mean, wow. Fantastic shave. Um, the Shaveology Griffin Razor right here. It just, it really is just a terrific, terrific razor. Just, wow, it just knocked it out of the park. There it is with the logo there. It's got a little bit of water on there, but boy, terrific, terrific razor. This paired with the, the Shaveology shave cream, this and this, absolutely terrific. Now, Shaveology also makes their own blades. I believe they recently started doing that, and they have a pre-shave oil, and they have an entire kit for about $70, $75, somewhere in there, and they give you a lot of stuff. So for the price of a really high-end, say, Mueller razor, uh, you're getting uh, an entire kit with a fantastic razor, shaving cream, pre-shave, uh, aftershave balm, blades, uh, cover, polishing cloth. I mean, they really do cover everything. I'll cover all the bases. Check them out at GoShaveology.com. Uh, also, really important, a part of the proceeds uh, go to um, Soldiers Angels, a really great group that supports our military families. So when you make a purchase from Shaveology, you're also supporting a really great cause in Soldiers Angels. And uh, I think that's really very commendable of them. So, Shaveology Shave Cream, the Griffin Razor, all the other great stuff, check it out. It really, really is very, very good. Hey, thanks very much for tuning in. Really appreciate it. Comment below. Let me know. Check out my blog, georgetune.com slash blog for my comic strip, George, other cartoons, other videos like this. And I'll see you again real soon.